Welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we are going to unbox and quickly look over the Instant Pot, Viva, Black Stainless Steel 6 Quart 9-in-1, Multi-Use Programmable Pressure Cooker. Before get started, if you are new here and have not subscribed to this channel, please help us by subscribing. If you like this video, please hit the like button below. Thank you for your help. At the very beginning, let's unbox the box and see what they have sent us on the box. For your knowledge, this video is not sponsored by Instant Pot, and I haven't got the product for free. I brought this from a local Walmart and at that time, the price was about $50 with a discount. You can check the video description for any available discount. Without a discount, the price will be around $100 in Walmart or Amazon. As you know, prices are subject to change. This pressure cooker is a multi-cooker that pressure cooks, sautés, sous vide, steams, slow cooks, warms, makes yogurts, cakes, and sterilizes putting a world of culinary options at your fingertips. In short, it multitasks as well as you do, which makes it your perfect kitchen go-to. We are going to use this mainly for rice cooking, as well as other food. In this video, I'm going to show you cooking the rice. Later, following its tech book directions, I sautéed and then pressure cooked a pork roast in it. Then once it cooled down, I added small potatoes, pressure cooked an additional 10 minutes, and I had an amazing meal. The digital controls are similar to a microwave oven, with many choices and presets. It beeps to notify what process is occurring. Other than the beeps, there is no noise like the old-fashioned pressure cookers. Look at here, my son likes to play with whatever he found around him, but this is not a kid's toy though. This is the most popular size capacity. 6 quart large capacity is good for cooks for up to 6 people. Perfect for families, and also great for meal prepping and batch cooking for singles and smaller households. This is so easy to use, and it's the perfect size for our family. I've been making a lot of stews, and also sauté the onions, carrots, and meat, if I'm using meat, then add everything else seal it, and set it for 7 minutes on high pressure. I let it release naturally and have a perfectly cooked, tasty meal every time. Later, I will make a video about the details of using this. For now, let's cook rice on this cooker. Like always, please wash the parts before using even though it is new. Washing makes bacteria and chemicals free from production and packaging. I put 2 cups rice and about 3 cups water. Then cooked with rice cooking program from factory option. We will see how it works. To avoid any electrical damage, please dry out the pot before placing it in the base. That helps to keep clean the base and any risk free. And also make sure you disconnect the power cord while placing the pot, just for more safety. Now I have placed and covered it. I am going to connect with power. As you can see, there are many cooking options but for now we are going to click rice option. Here they have set timer and pressure. When you click on it, it will automatically start the timer, or if you want, you can adjust it too. After you make sure it is ok, it will show auto on display and start cooking. You can see, now it has full of pressure. You can cack pressure looking the small Y valve. If you want to release the pressure, you can turn this button. This is the only way to release the pressure or stream. But be careful, 
It is very hot and it can burn your hand. Please avoid touching this if you have naked hand and cooker as an operation. Alright, our rice is ready to eat. After cooking done, you can see this raising times in display, that means it is past time of our food ready. We are going to release pressure and check how cooked rice look like. You can see, it is perfect and looks great. At the end, thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please help us by hitting the like button below. I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.